Hi everybody and welcome to another Monday plan with me. Sorry, I'm just adjusting my camera. Uh, this week I'm going to be planning from the 20th of August to the 26th. This is how last week turned out. I am going to be using the Unicorn Wishes Kit from Fantasy Designs Store. These are the headers. Four boxes and a weekly checklist. Half boxes, quarter boxes, date covers and date dots. Functional weekend banner and checklist flag. Um, I've also pulled in this bottom washi I had left over from a project plan kit and I'm going to use the two glitter strips left over from my May monthly I think it was from planning by Miss Eve and I have all my functional stickers on this sheet I thought it'd be easier than bringing like 30 different sheets out thought I'd also show you what kit I'll be using in my TN for that week it is this macaroon kit from the Punk Planner there's the full boxes and the half boxes and the deco as well as these glitters as well so I'm going to speed through placing down the kit and I'll get back to you with the functional so I'm going to place all the main parts of my kit down as usual I'm placing the bottom washi along the bottom here and then those thin strips of washi above that here I can't find my ruler so I use um, one of these tab type paper clips but um, I did tell you in I think it was my last plan with me I'd update you on my youngest daughter after she'd been to the dentist she has got to go and have them out at the hospital so we're just waiting for an appointment for that I'm just going to now place my four boxes um, there were four hang on let me get this right there were four one two three four, four quote boxes and four plain boxes so I just had to check to make sure that I separated them so I didn't have a quote box next to a quote box um, after putting all this together I think I should have only used three colours of the headers because um, the purple colour matches the back of the box so I don't think it really went well but nothing you can do once it's all placed down but you'll see by the end of this video it did turn out alright um, not much plans going on this week um, I have got a bit well quite a bit of filming to do realised I'm behind on filming a few videos so I need to get that done it is currently Friday the 17th and I'm doing this voiceover now I've also got to film my TN spread which goes up on the 16th, 18th 
and I've also got to try and film a flip through from January to June so I've got a lot of filming to do here I've just placed some simply gilded washi along the top and then putting the date covers underneath with my flip through I'm not sure whether to um, talk while I'm going through it or do a voiceover because I don't know how much I want to talk about a spread so it leaves it hard to decide how to work it out if you do a voiceover how long to stay on a spread as I'm filming it I do know my phone doesn't pick my voice up very well which causes volume issues for people so I'm just not sure here I'm sticking the this week header at the top of the notes section and putting the last quote box above that I've decided to use the weekly checklist to mark down what things I want to share to Instagram I do write social above it, I think I should have just wrote Instagram and then I use some more of the headers with a habit tracker for skincare and then a half box which I need to find a quote for to stick in it. So that's all the kit placed down, now on to the functional stickers, first off I use a quarter box from the kit just to cover up the line and I use the caffeine required unicorn from the kit with a Hello Monday sticker from Your World of Colour. I then use one of these bow clip stickers from Stationery Heaven Co to mark up I want to share my weekly spread along with a kitchen script word from Your World of Colour. I then take a half box and put a right blog sticker from the Plump Planner to mark that I need to write the blog post to go with this plan with me. I then use a design quarter box from Samantha May Sticks to mark that I want to design some thumbnails ready for Christmas and then lastly I use a YouTube poppet from Laura Jane Style to mark that this plan with me would be going live at 5pm. Moving on to Tuesday I use a film sticker from Laura Jane Styles along with a TN sticker from Stationery Heaven Co. I then take another quarter box from the kit with a Stationery Heaven Co. Instagram sticker and write TN Tuesday. Um, I don't know if that's a thing but it sounded right to me and seems great for sharing my <coughs> TN spread as well. Then I use a living room script sticker from Your World of Colour and then down at the bottom I place another quarter box first so I know the space I had. I use a write blog again so I know to do some blog work and then stick a unicorn chilling on the quarter box and write Netflix so I know I want to watch some Netflix. <coughs> I then use a edit and upload sticker from Laura Jane Style. So I know I need to edit and upload my January to June flip through. I then use a midweek sticker from Samantha May Sticks and sadly this is my last one. I then use another quarter box just in case anything comes up and then use a bathroom script word underneath. All my house rooms ones are from Your World of Colour, saves me keep saying it. I use this appointment box from 
the ginger cat curl to mark I have the council coming out at 3 pm. I then use another YouTube pop it to mark that my flip through will be going up at 5 pm on this day. And then I use an online grocery sticker from Happy Cutie Studio. Moving on to Thursday, I use the Payday Unicorn from the kit. I place another piece of washi just to cover, well not washi, it's one of the headers, just to cover up that line and then stick it on top. Underneath that I use a next week script word from the Ginger Cat Co to mark that I want to share the kit I'll be using the following week. And a buy more stickers, I think these were from Stationery Heaven Co. To mark I want to place an Etsy order. And a MOT sticker from the Coffee Monsters Co. To mark it, I need to do the voiceover for my TN spread. I then use a half box and another pump planner blog sticker to mark that I want to do a blog post to go with my flip through that went up on the Wednesday. <coughs> I then use a edit sticker from Laura Jane Style to mark that I want to also edit my TN spread. On to Friday I use the Stationery Heaven Co. Facebook sticker to mark that I need to do some promoting for your world of colour. I then use the film sticker from Laura Jane Style and the planner sticker from the kit to mark that I need to film next week's plan with me. And uh, underneath that I use a bathroom script word. Can't wait to order some more stickers. I will be getting some foiled overlays for the headers from Diamond Prince Designs. Moving to the bottom I use an upload sticker from <coughs> Laura Jane Style and just where I've placed that quarter box I use a TV sticker from the kit and write YouTube next to it because I want to catch up on some YouTube videos that aren't planner related. Moving on to Saturday, I place a bit of Simply Gilded Washi so I can place my weekend banner down. And then starting with Saturday, I use a emoji again from the Coffee Monsters Co. to mark that I want to do the voiceover to my plan with me. If anybody knows of anywhere that actually sells a voiceover, stickers please comment down below because so far i can't find any i found the mixed sheets but i'd rather have a sheet of each one not mixed sheets they go down too quick underneath this i use a facebook sticker from stationery heaven co to mark that i need to do some promoting for the punk planner and then I place a quarter box underneath that in case anything comes up. Underneath the weekend banner, I place an edit sticker from Laura Jane Style to mark that I need to edit next week's plan with me, as well as a YouTube pop it to mark that my TN spread would be going live at 5 pm. And one of these girl stickers from Miss Cinder Charlotte. To mark that I'd like to have an early night. Lastly, on to Sunday, I use a washing line sticker from Whimsical Cat Co. To mark that I want to do some laundry. I know I've only put one laundry sticker down this week. That's just because I know Sunday is a main laundry day. I do do other laundry throughout the week, but that all depends when 
I want to do it, that's why I don't mark it any other time. I also use this bed sticker, I don't know where it's from, um, called, it says make my bed underneath it, just so I know I need to change all the sheets. I then use an upload sticker from Laura Jane Style with a half box to mark that I need to upload this plan with, no, next week's plan with me. And then I use the bath and relax sticker and read and relax sticker from the kit to mark that I want to have a pamper night. Um, that's all my functional apart from this build, uh, build due sticker I forgot to put in before to write we have rent due. Um, but that is all of my functional place down. I'm going to place some deco. Sorry video got away with that, me there. Um, I put some stickers down at the bottom from the kit uh, but this is my kit my spread finished um please subscribe if you haven't already and i will see you in my next video bye